Today we're going to learn how to replace Calendly with Go High Level. I personally love Go High Level because it replaces everything I used to use and I was a little bit reluctant to use it instead of Calendly because whenever you have clients coming in and booking demo calls and booking discovery calls with you that's a really big piece of the puzzle. Um, so I was a little reluctant, but now that I've got it to work and I figured it out, I'm going to turn around and teach you guys how to do it. So by the way, I am Jordan English and I am the creator of the white label version of Go High Level called My Command Center. And the reason why I have done this, two parts. Number one, I wanted to have a way to help my clients do all of these things like email marketing, text marketing, all of that. But I also wanted a way to create sales for myself as a SaaSpreneur, which is software as a service. So if you're interested in learning more about how to create your own agency account where you can turn around and white label go high level, comment below. Um, also, if you are interested in my version of go high level, which is called my command center, there's also a link below for that. Or if you just want your own regular go high level account, there's a link for that below as well. So be sure to check those out. So first of all, we are going to go to calendars and then we are going to go to calendar settings. So from here, you are going to be able to click create calendar and you can do a simple calendar, a round robin, a class booking or a collective booking. So most likely you'll be using the simple calendar where you can do discovery call. You can add a description. You can add a um, widget, custom URL, so discovery call, and it might be already taken, um, discovery call with Jordan. You can set the duration, you can set the availability, just like in Calendly, and you can do a meeting location, which is Zoom for most of, most of us. And you can also accept payments now with this platform. So $2.97 for a one hour coaching call. You can input the description there and do advanced settings. And this is where you'll go through and you can actually add a calendar logo. You can write your description. You can change the color. You can do a little bit more in the availability section where you can again do the meeting intervals. You can do a minimum scheduling notice, a date range, all of these things just like Calendly. Um, forms and payments, you can select if you want to have like a special form for people to fill out, you can go create that first in the form section, which I'll go over in a different video. And you can add guests, you can do pre-populated fields, you can accept payments, and you can turn this live here. Notifications, you can do an acknowledgement email and you can select who you want to get these and also i love to check this allow google calendar to send invitation that way in the email they can just hit add to google calendar connections link to calendar make sure that you have your um, connections there which you can do in the integrations part of the settings and customization so you can go through here and select all of that but the next thing that you need to do once you've set up that is you can actually go to sites and then I've created a one-on-one -on -one business coaching called booking page so I created a really simple page for this that way it looks kind of like Calendly does whenever you land on it so I just have my logo at the top book a one-hour coaching call and so I have the information here and it looks just like Calendly so someone can click on it and go to the next page put in their information put in their credit card number and if you want, if you want to be able to access my templates where I can just literally drag and drop this page into your account, you will need to click that button below that says get my command center. Um, and you can have access to all of my templates. It's one of the beautiful things about having my white labeled version of go high level is if you see something on one of these videos and you're like, Jordan, I want this, I can drag and drop it into your account. And it's as easy as that. So, from the other piece of this puzzle is the domain, the link. So you can have like a normal link or you can connect your domain to Go High Level. So that is, um, you can go under settings and select your domain here. And you can create the path, you can enable your chat widget. And then you can also have a thank you page after that. 
and if you want to learn how to connect your domain I actually do have a video of that on my channel so go find that because it is a little tricky but it's actually super simple once you figure out what it is but a lot of people get really nervous messing around with domains but I'm here to tell you it's super simple so if you have any questions again please drop them in the comments below but that is how you create your Calendly look like inside of go high level the only other thing that I did not show you is how to connect your zoom and I will do that in a separate video as well because I have to log in a different way but I'll link that below as well all right bye guys